family member yeah, to our audience. Well, that's it. The new actress with its three major virtues. Number one, comfort. And this is symbolically represented here by the most comfortable limousine worldwide, the S-Class. And the second virtue is driving dynamics. And this, again, is symbolized by the highly dynamic product produced by our company, the SLS. And the third major virtue is, of course, profitability. And this is symbolized by some um, fuel lines here, because the more actors we print on the road, the fewer will you have to call in service stations, and the fewer these products will be needed. Well, Andreas Rentler and Georg Weilberg mentioned it before. It was our objective to create a new truck that meets the very ambitious Euro 6 standards, but on the other hand, to do the nearly impossible, namely reduce fuel consumption. How did we do it? And Georg mentioned it before, we designed a completely new truck, starting with the engine, the most modern engine in the commercial vehicles industry, the OM471 is here below the hood. And its sister engine is really making thousands of customers at Freightliner quite enthusiastic by low fuel consumption and high performance performance and to achieve our consumption objectives and our performance objectives we really optimize the complete drive line not just the engine of course the completely newly developed cab is also uh, absolutely new thousands and thousands of hours were spent in the wind tunnel to optimize every profile every edge every radius of that cab i hope the camera can see the a pillar was optimized in the wind tunnel also these wind deflectors and uh, the windshield is at an angle to reduce drag and if you a look at the headlights. Here you see the wind is actually caressing the profile of the headlights between the air deflector to really optimize the drag coefficient. Since we uh, developed a completely new track, we saw a unique opportunity, uh, opportunity which is really unique in the industry to introduce a shutter, a radiator shutter. And uh, this shutter that can be opened and closed as required. Let's here a look behind the grill. Here in the lower part, you see the shutter being closed. In the top part, as you can see, it's open. If there is no major cooling requirement, given the temperatures at the moment, of if you don't have to climb up any steep hills and mountains, then we close the shutter so that uh, the wind that generated by driving is not trapped in uh, the engine com uh, compartment, but is really ducted around the cap, which improves aerodynamics. But over and above that, also the ancillary equipment was optimized so that they are only activated at request and at requirement that is the main compressor. The steering pump, which is really absolutely new, and if, for example, truck driver that doesn't do a lot of steering interventions, so then the power steering pump is not active, which also helps to reduce power, fuel consumption, of course. And that, in a nutshell, are the main features. This is a brand new engine, the most state of the art of our industry, optimized driveline, a perfectly aerodynamically designed cab, and also uh, controllable ancillary equipment that is only activated at requirement. So we see uh, fuel savings of minus 5 to 6 percent, uh, Euro 5 standard, over the current Actros. And if it's Euro 6 compatible, it's 3 to 4 percent less. And I'm convinced uh, that this is an extremely attractive product which we offer to our customers. Now, we know from our customers that we need to work really hard on that vehicle to reduce fuel consumption. But another important factor is the driver and driving power. 
patterns. If you look at a Hollywood's uh, fleet, you see the difference between uh, driving patterns can make, account for 5 to 10 percent of difference in fuel consumption. So with the new attracts as a standard, we offer our telematic system called Fleetboard free of charge as a standard to help to see operators how you can save on fuel. We know that customers using Fleetboard now have seen significant reductions in fuel consumption. So that all in all, and we've got the first feedback from our customers, that our customers, the entrepreneurs, the holders will be quite enthusiastic about this new vehicle. But it was not just a matter to really please the the operators, the entrepreneurs, but also the drivers. But what you need to make a driver happy? Of course, a dynamic vehicle. Driving dynamics are important. Maybe you are saying, oh, he's exaggerating 80 kilometers top speed, um, talking about driving dynamics. That sounds exaggerated. Yes, fair enough. But many of the 130 to 150,000 kilometers in long distance haulage happen in very narrow country roads and in uh, road around roadworks. And it makes a big difference to a driver if you can handle and drive and steer a vehicle easily through these difficult and tight patches, or if you always have to really turn the steering wheel to adjust uh, your direction of driving, uh, not to be afraid to bump into any barriers. So we completely redesigned the vehicle with a wider frame, wider track. So uh, the vehicle is a really uh, very um, solidly on the road, and it makes for a very relaxed driving. The first vehicles, of course, camouflaged vehicles. Um, here we said, let's have, let's have 40 customers drive the vehicle. And after a few kilometers, we hear from our uh, customers and test drivers that they hate to uh, switch trucks after the two weeks of test for each individual driver. That was the plan. Uh, they really love it. But what else can you do to make a driver love his truck? Or truck for that matter. So if you spend weeks behind the steering wheel, sleep and live in a truck, then quality of life is important. And we really wanted to offer the perfect one bedroom, living room and office truck. Let's get into the truck. I'm not probably dressed for the occasion if I want to get into that truck. You don't sit behind the steering wheel of a truck with a suit and tie, but still. Let's get inside after I've got rid of my tie. Welcome to the workplace in a new Actros. Here you see a completely redesigned workstation. So the driver is truly in focus as regards the ergonomics and the arrangement of all the control and operating elements. The um, value, appreciation, and perception of the truck is optimum. And of course, we tried to really enable each type of driver to find the perfect seating position. And so the adjustment range of the seat is nine centimeters longer as compared to today's actors. That's quite a bit. Because you can imagine not every truck driver or, for example, Ms. Janine, uh, Janina Martin is not your common and and truck driver as regards um, her physical appearance, uh, this wide adjustment range really is benchmark and is right for each and every truck driver. But let's move to the living area, the living room of the truck driver. Now what catches your eye immediately is a level floor. 2 meters also, 13 standing height, so Dirk Nowitzki could uh, stand up here gelernt, comfortably. But uh, of course, unfortunately, he is not a what truck driver. He has got a license. He only learned to play basketball. Kabine. But the, the uh, space in this cab, which is really the, the gigaspace, gigaspace cab, the biggest cab we can offer, as compared megaspace, to today's megaspace cab of the Actros, is one cubic meter. Just to illustrate this, one cubic meter more than 
are 28 crates of beer. Of course, we don't encourage our drivers to just uh, stack 28 crates of beer in the car. No, just to illustrate the added space. Part of that space is uh, really attributable to uh, these storage compartments. A crate of mineral water, not beer, can be stored here. But what's also new and other innovative feature for the single driver cap, we developed the so-called Solo Star concept. Well, it's a chill-out corner, you know, where you could lounge and hang out after a hard day's of work. And you won't find that much space in any other truck. Also, again, if you look at the color design and the use of materials instead of your traditional gray and black, we uh, have chosen lighter colors that are more attractive, um, make for a more spacious appearance, the beige. So we said we will redesign the lounge corner and also the bunk area, beds 2 and 2 meters 20 long, 75 meters wide. Uh, um, 75 centimeters wide, and I think this really makes for a very comfortable ride and also a comfortable sleep in that truck. I could tell you more about that vehicle, but I think you really want to see the vehicle close up now for yourselves and get inside that cab and also on the occasion of the workshops tomorrow you will have plenty of time to get to know the vehicle but there's one feature I just wanted to share with you before I leave you to it but I need to get out of the cab first as you know Every driver prior to starting has to do a checkup of the vehicle to test the functional reliability of the truck. And in order to make life easier for the driver, we've developed the so-called multifunction key. And let's just uh, see what it's like here. Uh, this multifunction key offers several features. You can lower and lift the vehicle, but you can also do uh, the checkup and the technical checkup before the, you start. You can activate the headlights and you get the feedback on the display, on the actual display, that all the functions are okay that the truck is okay and that it's safe to start off. Ladies and gentlemen, we are convinced that both the operators, the entrepreneurs and the drivers will love the vehicle and we hope, and that's also part of uh, what we intended with this event, that you will also love it. So thank you very much for your attention, ladies and gentlemen.